What's going on guys? In this video right now, I'm going to show you how to algo trade the markets, whether it's crypto or it's equities or futures. I know algorithmic trading sounds so daunting and so scary, but as you and I both know, most trades are done by robots. Now you don't have to be a super genius to be able to algo trade. That's what algo traders want you to think because they don't want you to build these super simple strategies that out trade you or I. The reason algo trading is so great to get into and so much more profitable is one main thing and that's your emotions, right? For example, Let's look at this chart here. This is, I think this is a chart of crypto uh, or Bitcoin. So you see that it go, you're in a position right here. Let's pretend you're right here. You see it goes up, 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 up. And you're like, oh, it's going to keep going up. It's going to keep going up. And that's emotion right there saying, hey, I don't want to sell because it's going to keep going up. But then guess what? It went back down. Yes, at the end of the day, if you're just going to hold on, that's a great strategy. But if you want to make profits from going up and then making profits going down and then making profits going up again, the only way you can do that is if you have a computer doing it for you, right? And people do this all day long. I've met a ton of algo traders that are no different than you and I. You know, I come from a more entrepreneurial background where, you know, for the longest time I didn't know how to code and I didn't do any coding simply because everybody said it was so hard. You know, developers like to talk in, in big words and words that we don't typically understand, but it's just like any other industry. Whether you're in the marketing right now or you're an entrepreneur or you have a job, every industry has different words. Now, the terminologies that developers use tend to be kind of kind of scary, in my opinion. And when I look at code, it's like, holy smokes, what is this, right? Like, I could never learn how to do that. But guess what? It's really not that hard. It comes down to some reading, some watching of videos. There's so much content here on YouTube that just shows you exactly how to do it. So I don't know about you, but I'm trying to learn Spanish right now. And I, I was also spending the last few years learning how to code. And I can tell you one thing, learning how to code is so much easier than learning Spanish as an English speaker. So I don't know where you live, but if you've ever tried to learn another language, that is so much harder than learning how to code. And if you're sitting there and you're a trader or you're an investor, don't you think it'd be worth it to learn a couple easy strategies to code that anybody can do as long as you have a little bit of time? Don't you think it'd be worth it if you could increase your trading profits or your investing profits by 20%, 30%, 40%? It's super doable. It takes all emotions out of trading and you know, it's just so worth it to spend a little bit of time on it because then you can profit up, down, up, down. This is a daily chart, but we can even get into like a 15 minute chart. Algos can profit here and then they can short here and then long here and short here. Now, if you believe a market is going to go up in the long term, you just make some tweaks to your settings that say, hey, I want to be longer. I want to I want to long more often than short. But of course, if we're headed up towards resistance or something, let's short it really quick. That's really, really hard to do if you're just sitting there looking at the charts all day. And, you know, that brings me to another good point. Like who the heck wants to sit there and look at the charts all day? I don't. I've done that. And it is just it's so mentally exhausting that eventually I was just like, all right, whatever. I'm just going to spend a couple years and learn how to code. And guess what? Within three months, I had my first algorithm going and out trading me. So, you know, I'll show you exactly how to set up your first algorithmic strategy. Uh, of course, I have like a boot camp that you can join. There's a link somewhere below or in the video somewhere, but I want to show you how to get set up right now, even if you don't know how to code. So, you know, even if this is a little advanced, just trust me, I'm a normal dude. Like, you know, I grew up playing sports, kind of looked at as a jock, right? A jock could never learn how to code and he could for sure never learn how to algorithmic trade. But guess what? My algos are out trading me 24-7, 365. 
And I'm just that dumb jock that doesn't know how to code and will never know how to algo trade for sure. Like that stuff was just like, nope, you can't do it. Can't do it. <laughs> There's no way. Right. Um, but at the end of the day, it was just a limiting mind mindset. So let's just jump over here to Visual Studio Code. Um, I have this editor up now. If this is too far ahead for you, don't worry. Um, I can, you know, I have all these videos on my YouTube channel. Just make sure to subscribe and. Um, you'll be able to see everything and just kind of piece it together at the end of the day Just don't let that limiting belief of hey, you know only coders can do this or you know Only super smart math people can learn how to code Like I said, I grew up playing sports as the dumb jock and now I'm out trading myself with my algo so the first thing we want to do is we want to import CCXT and CCXT you can look into that. I have other videos on it. Of course, I'll go over it in my boot camp, but it just helps you um, run all your trades so like you can connect to all the brokerages whether it's coinbase or uh, femex or binance or whatever you know i'm going to do a lot of crypto trading here because that's kind of the field that i like but i also use interactive brokers for equities and futures um, and like i said i have videos somewhere on this channel or in the boot camp that you can just follow along so i'm just going to fly through this to show you how easy it is i wish you could see me right now because i still look like a dumb jock you know, it's, don't worry about it if you feel like this is going to be hard because it just takes some hours and some practice. And that's one thing I did get from sports is like, you know, I got pretty good at sports because I just practiced. Uh, I love Kobe Bryant and he just practiced. He wasn't the best, best, right? So I'm doing all these imports and these imports just essentially make my life easier that's the great thing about coding is essentially right here. This is pretty much somebody who spent hours and hours and hours and days and maybe even years building out a bunch of code and then they let you just import it. So that's one thing about coding is you simply just import stuff and then you kind of put it together. So it's like if there's a ton of different video games that are out there, well, you can now import that game or that character into your your game and make your own game right so i'm doing all these imports here i'm going to import time x config i haven't created yet but i'm gonna go ahead and open this up into another panel command b command b opens the panel this is visual studio code i'm going to call this x config dot py this is where i'm going to put my like api keys and whatnot um and like i said you know don't worry if this is going too fast for you but let's go ahead and call this here first we need to connect to the exchange and then we want to go ahead and be able to make trades right so let's go ahead and get those two things done really quickly uh, super easy to do I'm gonna use Femix which is a cryptocurrency platform and I like them because it's you know you're able to use leverage if you know how to use it. Let's go limit equals true. And to be honest, a lot of this stuff, I didn't know what it meant either, but it doesn't matter because at the end of the day, if you get the main points down, you're going to learn over time. So essentially what I'm doing here is bringing in my X config and I'm going to put uh, Femex key and then I'm going to put the secret. So essentially with Femix and every other exchange, you can get a API key and a secret. And you put those two things in a different file. I put it into a xconfig because I want to be able to keep it safe. So for example, like I'm making a video right now, right? If I put my Femix key and my secret on this video, you could just withdraw all of my funds that I have in Phoenix. So that's why I'm setting it up like this into another folder and you'll put your actual keys in here. And I'll do that outside of the video, but it's gonna look like something like this. You just sign into the exchange, whether it's Coinbase, Phoenix, whatever. Um, CCXT is a package that pretty much connects to all of them. So you go ahead and do those two things. Now let's go ahead and try to uh, set up a couple buy orders real quick. So the cool thing about, like I said, these are building blocks. So I can say something like exchange dot 
fetch balance. I could do a fetch balance if I want to see like my total balance, right? So you would want to run that every time through like, hey, okay, we're running a trade. Let's see how much we have in balance. And then let's see, you know, what the price is at and if we want to make an order or not, right? So it's pretty easy to do. Um, if I wanted to make a order, I would say exchange and essentially typing exchange calls this information, right? So it's saying, hey, in this exchange, which is my Phoenix exchange, because I'm calling this from here. Well, then I can say create and you see all of these things pop up. I could create a limit order, a limit buy order, a limit sell order. So I could go long. I could go short. I could do market orders. I typically do limit orders. Um, I even do a little more advanced stuff that I can show you in other videos. Just make sure to subscribe. Oh, shoot. That is my timer. Um, but let's go ahead and finish this create limit order. Uh, YouTube only gives me like 10, 15 minutes per video. So what I'm going to do here is I'll make a part two. Just let me know below if you want to see a part two. Of course, I have the boot camp that will take you from, you know, beginner total total noob to expert algo trader um super simple i take you by the hand whether you're a trader right now and you want to learn algo trading or you're a developer and you want to learn algo trading whatever it's not hard to do just make sure to subscribe to my videos um hit the like button to make sure you see the next one and then if you want part two of this just go ahead and comment part two below and i'll go ahead and make part two um, and you can always join the boot camp and join our, our Discord server by clicking the link below. So other than that, I hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll catch you in the next video.